Good rainy morning, guys. Um, Stan and I are scheduled to go hit the woods again and look for some more homesteads. We've got a bunch of stone walls uh, he wants to show me and a new area that I've never been to. So we're going to do that. However, it is raining, so no big camera today. I'm going to bring the 360 with us. We'll see what we can get. Fully waterproof, right? That and the phone. So that's about all we can do today, which means we're probably going to see lots of wildlife because Gary didn't bring the camera. Let's go do this. We've been over this. If you refuse to use your turn signals, it's not safe, Gage. So you're riding in the back until we get that resolved and we get you retrained. Where do you see these stone walls, brother? Stan says he's lost. Uh-oh. We're in trouble now, buddy. So we got one stone wall right here. It's actually a T section right here. Look, I think the corner's over there. And it goes that way. That's where I think the long, beautiful view is moving. So this area of woods that we're walking today is uh, not too far from town proper. You know, just 500 yards down the hill here. This is a case of, you know, a hundred years ago, this place was bustling, and then as town grew up further and further and further to the south, they just abandoned it, and all the homesteads and everything that were up here just got left. So. You might hear some traffic noise in the background. We are not far out of town on this one, out of this portion of the video. We're gonna to travel to a couple different places today. You can see the city traffic down there. Not sure what this is right here, guys. Is this where they were just quarrying all the rock for their rock walls? I don't know. Hey, it's we know it's a new year detecting. Stan found the fence. <laughs> there it is, buddy, right where they left it, eh? <laughs> Look at, and it ends right here, two feet away from where he was walking. <laughs> All right, there's another stone wall right there. Going up the big hill here. So we crossed that last stone wall right there and the woods here look pretty empty so to quote the edge this doesn't feel south stan <laughs> yeah i think we've got to go back to the other side of the stone wall and uh head more west we're just going to split up for a minute here stan is actually going down the hill but I think where we came in, we were right close. There was a big stone wall. I think we just have to keep going down that first stone wall. It's got to go somewhere. It's... I just want to follow this for a little bit, see where this goes.
Got the old fence running right along here. That's a good sign. Way down the hill, I hear Stan yelling, so I think he's found something. I'll turn around and head back down there. And of course, we get the usual bush pigs out here. Lovely, eh, Stan? I gotta pick these beer cans up here. <laughs> oh, it covers your fire pit even. Oh, nice. <laughs> Is there a bag handy anywhere? I'll show you guys where we parked to come in here. There's a beautiful old cemetery. I've never been in it. I didn't know it was here. And uh, apparently it's one of the mother house cemeteries. So a lot of nuns are buried in there. Well, here's an old drum. But I mean, it's a pretty good slope here. Kind of flattens out right there. I mean, there could have been a home set up in there. Drums roll downhill. <laughs> I think it was somebody's. Was... There's where we parked earlier when we came in. But, uh,. So the big monument here was actually for the founding family of North Bay. Was he was born the same year as you, Stan? Like 1842? You're, you're stupid. <laughs> you're stupid. <laughs> Sorry to insult the Fergusons. <laughs> My old buddy. <laughs> Your old drinking buddy. Yeah, it's quite extensive. It goes a long ways, eh? It's a very, still burying. Oh no. I just stepped on one. Oh well. Step on the there ground. doesn't seem to be a whole lot of, they're not in nice rows here. <clears throat> not for this guy, okay? So. My loved ones are just going to take my ashes out in the bush somewhere and let them go. I don't want to be with a bunch of other people. I want to be alone in nature. And I, I'm assuming Stan's probably the same. You got her, bud. You got her. <laughs> we'll find a nice hill to, with a good outlook over the lake for you, buddy. <laughs> I appreciate that. Okay, this is really weird, guys. I'm walking through and one of my dad's very good friends, one of our old hunting mates, I just looked up and... There's his grave right there. I wasn't even reading any of the names or anything until I came to this one. I looked up and uh, well, I know the one beside it too. She was my teacher, my grade one teacher. Hey Bill, how you doing? That's kind of strange, Stan, that I, I just walked past 300 graves, didn't read a single one, got here, looked up, read these two, and I know these two. I find that strange. I'm going to show my brother this. He'll find that strange. That's what I said earlier about walking through here. I see too many people I know. Yeah, he did say that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's very peaceful and serene up here. And this uh, cemetery just keeps going and going. Right here behind us is, that's all the nuns. All these flat white stones. I'll show you guys that. And then we're going to move on to our next uh, bush spot. These are all bishops on the highest level. The, the most elite religious figures followed by all the reverends on the next tier and all the ladies are below them. Yeah. As, as if this, you know, I don't know. <laughs> God has a tiered system, God I has, guess. God has like from the president on down in management. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know if that's a joke yet, but whatever, it's true. 